Howdy y'all, Fuzzy Biker down here in Marnie, Iowa, Baxter Cycle, and look what they got laid out for us today. This is something I actually asked them to lay out for us. Uh, so let's start with the, uh, well, these are Revelry Racing fuel rails, 40 millimeter. I think we uh, had a video about those already, but here's what we're here to look at. These are the cams for the interceptor right here. This is the stock cam. This is the aftermarket cam. I rode a bike a week or so ago with, uh, this cam in it and it really it changed the sound and the whole character of the motorcycle very uh very aggressive bike i don't know if i can show this here but so look at that lobe now here's the uh, other one if you look at that lobe that looks more pointy this one looks more rounded you know so it has a longer duration higher lift all that neat stuff and then just look at the finish on this you know, this is like a milled piece here where this is a, uh, I don't know if it's forged or what, but this, like I said, this is a stock item. Quite a bit of difference, isn't there? Just the overall finish is much higher, but anyway, the, with the interceptor with this in there, it really, it really sang a good song, really ran good. Now this one over here is for the Himalayan. Isn't that neat? And uh, that's something I should put in mind, isn't it? <laughs> so they've got the Himalayan one. Uh, I think this is it right here. 275 bucks. I think they've got two of those right now in stock. And then this one here is for the 350, the Royal Enfield uh, 350. This has Meteor on it. I'm assuming you could use that not only in the Meteor, but on the Classic and in the uh, Hunter as well. I'm not sure about that. I have to call and ask Jeremy about that. But these are uh, 299. I think they've got a couple of these in stock of the uh, interceptor cams. And then over here it said all-in shocks that you need for your bike. But anyway, kind of neat, isn't it? I, I really like the way it looks. It just looks a lot more substantial than the stock. You know, these are the uh, oil ways for the, uh, to hold the cam in place. This is where the timing gear would go. Oil goes in the ends here to supply oil to the, uh, you know, races. Just very nice, very nice. Like I said, this is the one for the uh, Himalayan. I think you attach your timing gear to this end and i've heard that these will go in in an hour and same with these you know so they uh, say it actually almost takes longer to take the gas tank off and put it back on than it does to put these in quite a neat looking deal quite a neat looking deal. ah so here's the two boxes for the interceptor these are both for the uh 350 and these here are for the himalayan get yours today wahoo <laughs> life is good baxtercycle.com ask for jeremy tell him fuzzy biker sent you now get out there and ride, my friends.